hello I have got an extra craft haul video because this was my order from scrapbook.com it's taken seven weeks to arrive understandable given all of the restrictions and with Covid and not as many flights all that kind of stuff but better late than never and I've been holding out for this this should have been part of my May craft haul video but instead it's just going to be a little separate one because I don't I'm actually going to have a June craft haul video so I didn't want to wait and I doubt I'll be having a June craft haul video so I wanted to show you this so that I could start using it as you can see I've got heaps of goodies let's get stuck right in now first of all you can see I've got a couple of more Catherine Pula inks I absolutely love these you'll have seen my video maybe about different ways you can use these and I saw a scrapbook.com video actually I think it was where they were saying like this icing on the cake one would be great for um, invisible stamping if you know what that means um, so that you can stamp on it and then colour around it and then the outline is kind of faded and then this is just a midnight black as well which I've heard some really good things about so I grabbed those and then you'll maybe have seen some of my something new favourites for April which was Di Dan Reesley and she was using this Dilutions paint. This is a new style bottle with the lids at the bottom. It just looks so great the way when she spreaded it, it dried super quick and I definitely need something like that because I am a messy crafter. The other thing I got was this stencil pal from Deco Fall. Now I've been waiting for this to be in stock for ages. You can see it's quite big. You can see compared to that as my hand, it's huge. And I didn't realise, but I'm looking at it now and it's got two, two of them in it. I didn't realise it was a two-piece set. Let me just quickly grab that out. Oh wow, that is cool. I've got two of these. Perfect. They're quite flexible as well, which is good. Nice silicon. I did recently buy this little one, this Lift Off Couture Creations as well, which is a lot harder, so you can see the difference in size for that. But um, that is going to be fantastic for spreading stuff over my stencils. I also got this quick stick. Now this was in the sale, that's why I picked this one up. Um, I feel like I don't really need, it, need one because I do have the Mervy. Let me find it for you. I do have the Mervy one, um, jewel picker, and you see this has got on both hand. You see on both ends there's a different sized. Hopefully you can see that different sized picker points for picking up sequins. But it was on sale, so I did think I'd get it because it looks like it's got a um, like a little pokey tool as well as a pickup one. So we'll see how that goes, and then the rest of my order. Oh, sorry, no, I should say I did get also these sticky grid sheets so now this is designed really for putting um, your dies through your Sizzix Big Shot for example but I'm going to use it for my stamp positioning tool I got this idea from the uh, Jog Olo she was using them in her stamp positioning tool which I thought was going to be absolutely great because it's quite sticky so you can use them a few times as well now that is all I got because the rest of this is all magical forest but let's tuck into the rest of this I've been holding out for this magical forest collection by crepe paper look at this stamp set I just love these little characters they are gorgeous and the writing the style of writing on that as well is so good I also picked up the ephemera pieces probably easier to show you on the back actually those and then the sticker books now I absolutely love these sticker books you get so much in them but what I do not like about them is the amount of plastic I don't know why they all need to be separated like this in these plastic sheets please crepe paper I'm sure you're watching this video do something about it do, you know we, we don't need all of this plastic packaging really don't but the designs are beautiful as you can see here and the other one I got was this sticker sheet, so 82 stickers on one sheet. And they've got a little bit of gold foil on there as well. They are gorgeous. So I'm going to be using this for memory decks cards. I'll be using it for my 12 by 12 layouts, even card making. Okay, so I've just quickly undone that so I could give you a flip through. And turn this the right way for you and see some of these gorgeous colours so I always like to get the 6x8 pad because this is great for my pocket page notebook 
See some of these pages have got the foil accents. So this is great for traveller's notebook, pocket page notebooks, as well as 6x8 layouts, which I like to do as well. And of course, there's more gold foil. Oh, I like that. Just some beautiful designs on here. The other thing I like about it is it's the same designs as a 12 by 12 but obviously in a smaller size. So you can always then cut some of these out as the little ephemera pieces. That'd be great on the front of a book, wouldn't it? Rainbows, big, popular. Rainbows are big at the moment, really popular. Look at this. Just love those characters. So you can be sure you're going to get some rainbow themed layouts from me. Look at this. So cute. Whether I cut them out or use it as a layout, I'm not too sure yet. There's the reverse. I always get the cutabout sheets. These are This is where I'll probably use for card making. So, you know, these would be really nice to send on a card. They love you to the moon and back. Um... And it's, yeah, so difficult when both sides are just as beautiful. So hard to choose. Again, this one I got more in mind to cut these out. These are the bigger ones. But that's cute as well. And then I also got this sheet. So as you can see, quite a lot of the Magical Forest. That is the main reason for my order, because they had a lot of it in stock. And then along the way, I picked up some baggins. Like I say, that was in the sale. I've been waiting to get these for a long time as well as the stencil pals and that is a bonus I honestly didn't realize there was a set of two so that is really great and this was something I was also on the lookout for but only recently as was these so that is a great haul this should have been part of my Mother's Day present back in May so I did order it middle of April thank you for watching